Of course Ladybug saved my life. She never misses an opportunity to rescue her best friend. Didn't Georgianitis give you vertigo when you went up the Eiffel Tower? Oh, no. Ladybug knows me so well that she brought me an earplug to stick in my right ear. <gasps> right ear? Did she say right ear? This morning she said the ringing was in her left ear. I've got her this time. Are you going to tell oh. everyone? Of course I am. Lila is... A liar. Yes, oh. I know. But do you really think exposing her will make things better? If you humiliate her, she'll just be hurt more. Making a bad guy suffer has never turned them into a good guy. Ladybug and I are like two peas in a pod. So we just stand by and let her lie? As long as you and I both know the truth, does it really matter? You're right. Maybe it's not such a big deal. Good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon, Mrs. J. Good for you for taking the high road, Marinette. Hey, it's pretty cool back here. Lila? Here. Adrian? Present. Max? Present. <sighs> Stay focused now, Marinette. Marinette? Don't get distracted. Otherwise, you'll flunk Marinette? school. And then how are you and Adrian gonna get that house Marinette? and have three kids and the hamster... Marinette! <gasps> Spoostier's called your name three times already. Oh. <laughs> Looks like you have trouble hearing after all, Marinette. Why don't you come sit up here in the front row next to Lila? Uh, <laughs> Miss Boussier, this is incredible. My tinnitus, I don't feel it anymore. It's gone. It's a miracle. It must be Ladybug's doing. I can sit in the back now. Uh, excuse me, Miss Boussier, can I go and sit next to Marinette? Nino and I can't stop chatting it up. <laughs> you didn't think I let my BFF sit all by herself, did you? Excuse me, Miss Bustier. Can I move too, please? I'd like to sit next to Nino again. <laughs> Sorry, Lila. He's my best friend. Uh, can I have my old seat back too, please? Can I go back to where I was? Yeah, yeah. Me, too. yeah me too. A camera? Of course! Who better to make a movie about Cat Noir and Ladybug than Ladybug and Cat Noir? Ha! Uh. He really doesn't take kindly to competition. Take their miraculous! They're at your mercy! <laughs> I can't see anything! <laughs> Protect your miraculous! He could be anywhere! <laughs> Move! <laughs> Everything okay down there? Over there! He's gone. Why didn't he attack us while we were blinded? I don't know. It doesn't make any sense. Something must have happened that we didn't see, which explains why the Lucky Charm was a camera. Protect your Miraculous! He could be anywhere! Did you just pause the image? No. Did you see him freeze? No. I had my eyes closed because of the smoke. Me too. Okay, so that's why he didn't take our Miraculous. If nobody's watching him... He stops moving. Just like a movie. If nobody watches it, it's as if it didn't exist. Now we know how to defeat it. <laughs> Whoa, this is the craziest show I've ever seen. Uh-oh, it won't be easy getting people to stop watching him now. Looks like this show is a sellout. Time for the end credits, Cat Noir. <laughs> Close your eyes! Everybody, stop watching him! Just because it's colorful and shiny doesn't mean it's not extremely dangerous! <laughs> TV! Of course! Cat Noir, keep him busy! So, you jealous of our success, huh? You can play the smart aleck cat, but once I have your miracle, if everyone will forget about you soon enough! Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Watching me from the other side of the screen. Wherever you are, close your eyes. Do not look 
Mega Animaestro, turn off your screen. Huh? Why isn't this bus making any noise? Well, because it's a modern bus. It runs on electricity. An electric bus? That's not how it's done! Buses make noise. They run on gas and spew out stinky black smoke! Away with modern buses! What's all this? There's a flying Superman girl in Paris now! Yep, girl and superhero. You gotta get with the times. That's not how it's done! It's up to the police or the army to carry out law enforcement, not you! Just minutes before the unveiling of the ultra-modern Star Train, I've been told that a super gall is wreaking havoc right here in Paris. I'm going to read Paris of all this modern nonsense, starting with you! <laughs> <laughs> Well, technically, I'm not actually all that modern. My miraculous is from ancient times! Well, we didn't have superheroes in my youth! <laughs> there will be no superheroes in my Paris! <laughs> Looks like Ladybug's the one unveiling a brand new method of air transport. Flag, on down! Lady, I'm right here. Thanks, Cat Noir, but girls don't always need to be saved by boys. You think I'm a tad old fashioned, don't you? Oh, I've seen worse than you. Just wait till you meet Baker X. <laughs> Thanks, Andre. <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, I'm filming you. Ah, telephones are for telephoning, not for filming. That uh, is not how it's uh, done. Hey, that's censorship. Just like the good old days. Oh, oh. oh. An Egyptian pyramid in the king's court? But that's not how it's done! A blending of ancient and modern. I personally like this glass pyramid a lot. It's proof that you can be modern and still respect the past. Treachery! Treason! I think we'd better destroy that flask of his. You're right. That's probably where the Akuma is, too. <gasps> You're out of your league! You don't have enough experience! Girls, we have a very serious situation! Adrian and his father have been invited to the royal wedding in England this weekend. That's the emergency you called us over here for on a Saturday morning? You don't get it! Kagami and her mother are going too! Which means that Adrian and Kagami will be spending an entire weekend together! Adrian is blown away by her awesome dress and hairstyle. And if they dance together at the reception, and what if they tour the city on a romantic horse and buggy ride? It would be the end of the world! They're taking the Star Train to London at 11 a.m. That's in less than two hours! We gotta do something fast! Uh, we could organize a demonstration and make the trains go on strike. Nah, they just take a helicopter or a private jet. I know! We'll dress you up as British megastar Adeline so you can slip into Buckingham Palace! You'll lure Adrian away from Kagami at the reception and we'll all put him in the grand ballroom and... Then, when Adrian finds out you're not who he thought you were, he'll be totally disappointed because he hates lying. He'll fall head over heels in love with Kagami, given that she never lies, and you'll get locked away in the Tower of London. Mm, why don't you just kidnap Kagami? That's cool. Oh! Mm -hmm. That no would be No way bad. we could do that, Julika. We couldn't. Listen, Marinette, the best thing to do is just spill your guts to Adrian once and for all before he takes off for London. Couldn't we try Julika's idea instead? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. But I just can't do that. I can't talk to him without stumbling all over my words. I've been trying for months and... <gasps> And you're right! <laughs> it's about time things change. I'll find the courage somehow. Thanks, girls! You sure you'll be okay? Yeah, sure, I'll let you know what happens. Bye, girls! Well, Milady Noir, it looks like you're playing the easy part today. Not so sure about that! Looks like we'll be taking on two opponents with each other's powers! Stay focused, Mr. Bug. Use the yo-yo as a shield. Ow! They've swapped their miraculouses. And they're struggling with their new powers. Make the most of it, Reflector. Their miraculouses are within your reach. Yes, Hawkmoth. 
Just my luck. I'm gonna have to capture two Akumas instead of one. No, one Akuma and one Amok. Your ah! <laughs> Fucta has been re akumatized by Hawk Moth, but that giant doll of hers is a Senti monster created by the owner of the Peacock Miraculous. <laughs> okay, so we have to find Reflecto's akumatized object and the baby monster's Amok. <laughs> Can you manage, or should we switch back? Come on, I'm totally capable of doing it. I just need to use my luck. No, wait! Why'd you do that? Because it's too early. You don't know enough about your opponent yet. Watch out! It's reflected controlling a giant dog! But you don't know where the Akuma and the Muck are hiding! Tiki! This is a magic prison, Marinette! It looks like it's trying to keep me from finding you! There must be a way out of here! Rose, it's the one Cat Noir gave me. I may not be her prince. But I'm charming enough to free her. I forbid you to do so. Uh. <laughs> Marinette! Marinette! I'm okay. I can do it. Not being in love with her, losing my stick, won't keep me from saving her. Uh. I'll never give up. Never. You're not worthy of my daughter. The Miraculous, grab his ring. Wonderful as ever. Who wouldn't be in love with Ladybug? Oh, I. She also has some flaws, you know. Not all of us know how to land on our feet, so I guess we're gonna need a little bit of luck. Lucky charm! Oh. Do your thing, Cat Noir. Oh no! I can't find Ladybug anywhere. How will I ever get out of this mess without her? Cat Noir. Lady, if you've gotten your voice back, then you've defeated Silencer. It's safe to come and find you. Yes, yes, there's no danger now. Meet me outside the studio. I'll wait for you. Okay, I'm coming. I'll meet you outside the studio door. You've got to be the dumbest superheroes ever. How could you let the bad guy in on your plan? And what's with this fake lucky charm? I thought it was supposed to be magic or something, but it's actually just some crafty special effects. You took your time. Did something hold you up? <laughs> you thought you had us, didn't you, Silencer? But you're wrong. Ladybug still has her superpowers. That's impossible. I took your voice from you. How could you possibly have summoned up your lucky charm? I don't see how this is going to work any better than a lamp, but at least you got yourself a real lucky charm. I'm warning you, buddy! You haven't heard the last from Ladybug! Catch this, m'lady! Ugh! <sighs> 
Mom Guild again this year, Dad. Stop! Stop! receives a text message, you can't let them open it. That's how Oni-chan teleports herself. <laughs> oh, Cat Noir! It hurts so much! I think I might have broken something. Milady, I have an emergency. I won't be long. Are you sure she's not pulling your leg? She wouldn't do that now. She really looks like she's in pain. <sighs> then I'm gonna need a helping hand here. Lucky Charm! girl to the nearest hospital, please? You've been hosed, Ladybug. Adrian will be mine now, forever! No! Yes! Take her, Miraculous! Back off! Well, this is what happens when you don't wear knee pads. No! Don't look at your phone! But what if it's an emergency? Her leg's an emergency! Mm. You sure it's not her forehead instead? Because her leg looks fine. You just wanted me to leave Ladybug alone with the villain? You hate Ladybug that much? Me? Of course not. Why would you say that? Is it because she's been left alone to fight Oni-chan all by herself? What you just did is really terrible. You should be ashamed of yourself. Answer your phone, Mr. Hessen P. No, don't do that. Yes, it's an emergency. Uh-oh. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Ladybug. <laughs> Surprise, Oni-chan. <laughs> What am I doing here? And how did you get all tied up like that? These hoses are so strong, it once took us two full hours to get a kid untangled. Really? <gasps> Wait, I've got a plan. <laughs> <laughs> yes, milady, it's the girl of my dreams. Sure, I'll bring her over to you right now. <laughs> <laughs> situation if you and Ladybug had gotten me sooner. Uh, thanks, Chloe. That's super helpful. Uh, if I'd had my bee miraculous, I could have helped you. I'd have floored those two by now. Uh, Final. Shh. I've got a plan. Just listen. <laughs> Stay still, you mangy cat. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Come on. Sabrina, I've changed my mind. I do want Ladybug's power. They should have gotten me sooner. But since they chose not to, I've decided I'd rather play with you instead. Perfect. Just as I planned it. Mayura, grab Cat Noir's Miraculous. Oh, I'm so happy. We're going to have so much fun. Here's Ladybug's power. Mm. Thank you, Miracular. I really needed that back. Oh. You confused me for a pathetic illusion, and you claim to be my best friend. Oh. Huh? Not on my watch. Cataclysm! Ken Noir! I'm sorry, milady. I held out for as long as I could. Lucky charm! Cataclysm! Come back, Mayura. You've got the Bee Miraculous already. Miracula will take care of Cat Noir and Ladybug's Miraculous. I got this! Lost something? Chloe, follow Mayura. She's probably going back to Hawk Moth. You won't regret this, Ladybug. If my own mother doesn't know that I'm Ladybug, then nobody must know. What about us? Do you think we know? Hmm. I feel like we're more than just a superhero team. Do you think we're... Mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> Looks 
like it. <laughs> then we must have told each other everything. I couldn't hide my identity from the girl I love. <gasps> so, if we're the superheroes, then what are they? I have no idea. You can't just leave. We have to help them. We don't even know who we are or who they are. And I don't want to help out a couple of strangers. You may not remember who you are, but at least you know this about yourself. You're a selfish being and a total coward. Me? A coward? I am not a coward. I... I'm a free spirit, so don't come if you don't want to. But I'm out of here. <sighs> Did he go to get help? I don't think we should hold our breath. <gasps> Ladybug, Cat Noir, we know you're in here. You won't get away this time. You remember your BFF Oblivio, don't you? Don't tell us you've forgotten us. <laughs> I'm not convinced that this monster is really our best friend. One thing's for sure. If we're superheroes, he can't find out about our secret identities. How about some kind of diversion? We get out of here and take the emergency stairs. Sorry, I need this. I'll call you, then when he comes, we make a run for it. I'll use the tape to pull your phone back. Ready? No wonder I fell in love with you. You shouldn't have forgotten to switch off your phone. All her weapons come from her guitar case. We have to prevent her from using them, then destroy the case. Ready? Second chance! Second chance! Wait! Second chance! Second chance! Second chance! Wait! This time I know what to do. No more evil doing for you, Rolakuma. Time to de eli Gotcha! Bye-bye, little butterfly. Miraculous Ladybug! doing here? Found it. History repeats itself, Ladybug, but rest assured, one day I will be the one who rewrites it. <laughs> Thank you for trusting me. You were the right choice, Luca. I'm sure we'll see each other again soon. Look out! Why don't we watch a cartoon instead? I have patati and potato if you want. That show's for babies! I'm a big boy! <laughs> we could play with your snow globe? Ew! Oh. <sighs> hey, what's that? <gasps> that? Oh, uh, it's nothing. Hey, no fair! Come on, what are all those gifts? Uh, look, I can't tell you that these are the gifts I've made for Adrian's next 35 birthdays, because you'd tell your brother Nino, and he'd tell Adrian, and Adrian would think that I'm totally crazy! 
Wait, maybe I am. Hmm. I can't tell you I'm one of Santa Claus's elves on a secret mission, and that I'm looking after one of his boxes of gifts. You wouldn't be interested, though, because gifts are for babies, right? And you're a big kid. That's a lie! What, that you're a big kid? No, that you're one of Santa Claus's elves! I can't say anything more. Hey, wait! That means you can give me my Christmas present early! Grobotech Ultimate Destructor! It's easy! It's gotta be the biggest one in the box! Now, wait a minute. I thought toys were for babies. They are! Most of the time, but Grobotech's different! You don't say. Well, I'm sorry, but Christmas rules are very strict. You don't open gifts early. Santa gives them at Christmas, not at Easter or Halloween. Otherwise, you might as well have a bunny or a witch delivering your presents. But... Since you know him, you could ask him. Can't you just call him on the phone or send him an email? Oh, no. You never disturb Santa Claus, except at Christmas. The rest of the year, he's in the North Pole to be, uh, supervising the production of toys. Besides, your present isn't here anyway. We elves don't watch over gifts for kids we know. One of the other elves must have it. Santa's the only one who would know where to find it because he knows who's getting what. He has a list of good children. There is one exception to the Christmas rule. Really? What is it? What is it? Santa is allowed to make one exception, but only for the best behaved kid in the whole world. Who's the best behaved kid in the whole world? Maybe... Ladybug? <laughs> mm -hmm. Well, seeing as she saved Paris like a zillion times, that makes sense. Or a kid, for example, who cleans up all the mess he's made and plays quietly with toys that are for kids his age? Hello, my name's Max. Are you glorious and famous? Kelki, mm -hmm. we don't have time for that. Max is perfect for the job, trust me. We're going to the last car, to the door leading to the driver's cab. That's where Star Train is. Gonna have to be fast and in sync. Well, I handle Star Train and Cat Noir uses his cataclysm. We need you, Max, to teleport the train back to Earth so that I can summon up my miraculous ladybug so everything gets fixed. Got it. All you need to say is, Kelki, full gallop! Kelki, full gallop! <laughs> you, my dear super passengers. You can't stop me from living out my galactic dream. I shall conquer the universe! Mm. My little drones! Attack! Looks like I kind of got the spatial coordinates wrong. Well, I heard that your class was supposed to be visiting Big Ben. <laughs> True or false, Cat Noir has disguised himself as Mr. Banana. Uh, stay PG. 
Stay put! Soon we'll discover Cat Noir's true identity and his miraculous will be mine at last! There's something you don't see every day. Kwame Buster, I promised you Kwame's, and here they are. Now bring me all the miraculous in return. You can't get away from me. You're no match for Kwame Buster. Catch us if you can. Psst. Cat Noir, is that you? Ladybug? Just when I think I finally know you, you managed to surprise me again. That's very sweet of you, but I'm not Ladybug. I'm Multimouse. Ladybug has sent me to fetch your Miraculous to defeat Kwame Buster. How do I know I can trust you? Ladybug trusted me when she gave me a Miraculous, didn't she? Tell her I'm relying on her to bring Plague back. Okay, thank you. Oh yeah, Ladybug said you should meet her on the roof. I will catch you all! It looks like your owner has failed us, Tiki. We're doomed. Uh, Ladybug? I told you that my owner was the best! I'd never abandon you, Tiki. <laughs> Flag! Molo? Unify! Tiki? Molo? A metal detector? <laughs> when you created the Senti Monster, you put the amok inside your staff, right? Correct. Was your staff made out of metal by any chance? Partially, yes. There are only two places where your staff could be. Where the temple was, or... <laughs> Hey! <laughs> Hurry, milady! This thing already swallowed my stick whole! Go ahead, master! Uh, you sure it's the right time, milady? Ready to get the staff back? Uh, oh no, not the tongues. <laughs> yes, great work, feast! Keep those two miraculous nice and warm for me, and enjoy the other ones. You've certainly earned them. Mm. Uh. Yum, yum, miraculous! <laughs> wow, it's bigger on the inside. Oh, my stick! What is that? Is it digesting things or something? Whatever he swallows gets sealed here forever. In that case, we better hurry up and find out where the master staff is hiding. <laughs> Farewell, my dear ways. You're the best Kwame I could have ever hoped to have by my side all these years. It's been an honor to be your Kwame master. intact, otherwise the Senti monster would have disappeared. Be careful what you wish for. Cataclysm! <laughs> hmm? No more evil doing for you. Time to de evil Bye-bye, little butterfly. No! That's impossible! Ugh. I'm fine. The Mime. Repost. Ready? Fight! I'm gonna slice you into sashimi! <laughs> Wouldn't you be better off miming a cat noir to come lend you a helping paw, lady? I know what I'm doing! Be careful, the mind object disappears if you talk! Thank you, Captain Obvious! 
Clever as ever, m'lady. Uh, I won, Gamer 2.0! Release us! A game with just one round? Where's the fun in that, Ladybug? It doesn't end until you've battled all the characters in the game. But this is gonna take forever! That's the best part about it! The longer, the better! Mm. My turn! My turn! Frightening Gale, stormy weather, awesome! But a little too awesome for a first battle. Oh, my copycat! Nah, I'd be too good as myself. That'd be too easy. Hurry up! Choose Copycat and Cataclysm this game away so we can get back home! Fine, if we need to hurry this up. Ooh, ooh. You've got to be kidding me! What? I've always wanted to train pigeons. <laughs> there aren't even any pigeons in this stadium! <laughs> there is one, and I'm gonna call him Fiery Phoenix! <laughs> Mega Flop Phoenix! <laughs> it's gonna be the fastest victory ever! Uh, 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 go away, you flying rat! Ha! Double ankle grab and smash! Uh, Somersault rope drop! <laughs> Feathered face wash! <laughs> the volatile's elbow! Mr. Pigeon wins! Pounded Fiery Phoenix! After all, we've been through a lot together. We're not gonna let stormy weather defeat us, right, Kitty? As usual, I completely agree with you, Bugaboo. <laughs> The further the Earth moves away from the sun, the colder the temperatures will get. You're outside right now, Clara. How's it going? We're down to minus 40 degrees Celsius, Nadia. It's getting very difficult, but Ladybug and Cat Noir have donned their special ice suits so they can battle stormy weather on an equal playing field. Everything okay, Clara? The picture's gone down. The freezing temperatures have just cracked the camera, but I can view the battle. Everything's fine, Nadia. Icebug just called up her lucky charm. She's got a, a, a small object. It, it looks like a, a pencil. Uh, what's she going to do with that? Is Ladybug gonna do some coloring? Cat Noir is holding up a copy machine. I can't see much, but it, it looks like Ladybug is making a photocopy. Whoa! That was a huge flash! Wait! Stormy weather has been defeated! Yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! <laughs> 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 Queen Bee would have done it a thousand times better. And faster. Mm. One of these days, I'll send you both into orbit, Ladybug and Cat Noir! See, Mother? I can be as elusive as wind! Thank you for the miraculous, Ladybug. Nice to meet you, Cat Noir. I am Ryuko. What are you doing? This wasn't the plan! What plan? Ikari Gozen. Ladybug has helped your daughter escape by giving her a Miraculous. I don't know how she did it, but I want her Miraculous too! Kagane, you've disobeyed me yet again! And this time with the complicity of these so-called heroes! You are all going to pay! Ryuko, the plan! Surely Long must have told you about the plan! No, stay behind with Cat Noir. This is a personal matter between a mother and a daughter. <laughs> 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 What a masterful move, Ikari Gozen. Now, in just a few minutes, Cat Noir will transform back and his Miraculous will be mine! I behaved hastily. I failed. 
I am not worthy to fight beside you. You made a mistake, as I do every day, but that's not a reason to give up fighting. You're the only one who can help me. That's why I chose you. But we must work together as a team. We don't have much time left. Here's the plan. Hurry up before I transform back! You were right, Mother. I still have a lot to learn. You're starting to have some sense. That's good. <laughs> Hold your breath. Aim at the Boken. Oh, you're a fast learner. They have good teachers. Water Dragon! Wow. Kitty. Cataclysm! <sighs> Minipug, Kitty! I knew you'd solve my riddle. A basic security measure in case the watch is stolen. But now, I need to do something very important. My name's Bunnix. In the future, I'm a member of Ladybug and Cat Noir's team of superheroes. Well, the Ladybug and Cat Noir you're going to become, because right now, you two are more like Minibug and Kitty Noir. Within the team, I am the hero of the last chance. I'm called upon when everyone else has failed. That includes you two. Uh, hey, we just got you out of the stone, didn't we? Which means you must have failed somewhere too. Yes, well, no, it was actually your fault. Or more precisely, it will be. In the future, one of your cataclysms will accidentally damage my miraculous. That's how Time Tagger will be able to send me into ancient Egypt and get me stuck in stone. Wait, then how are we gonna do that without the Rabbit Miraculous? Do you have the watch? My watch? Yes, my watch. Our watch. Uh. <clears throat> so this was a Miraculous? In camouflage mode. Fluff, counterclockwise! Uh. But you are... So, Mini-Me, you get it now? You're me, and I'm you. Well, more precisely, I'm you when you grow up. Wow, I can't believe how cool I'm gonna be when I'm older! But wait, it doesn't make sense. I never gave you... I mean, her... I mean, I never gave either of you the Miraculous. You haven't given it to us yet, Mini-Bug, because you haven't yet realized just how awesome I really am. But don't worry, you will one day. <gasps> I'm gonna get a Miraculous! So cool! Fluff, snack time. You have to recharge your batteries. Hmm. Was it breakfast or dinner? What time will it be yesterday? Is it tomorrow already? When it'll be the day after tomorrow, it will have been yesterday again. That miraculous seems so powerful. How come we don't use it more often? Because traveling through time is very dangerous. Interfering with events can have serious consequences. Oops, time to feed my Kwame too! I don't understand. If you're from the future, then you gotta know how this all ends. Your younger self has seen it with her own eyes, which means you obviously know how to defeat Time Tagger. Actually, uh, I've spent so much time in stone I can barely remember. But I think the logical thing to do would be to take Time Tagger back to the future so he can be defeated by heroes his own size. I'll take care of this. Awesome! One thing I remember for sure is... Mini-Me has to be there when I defeat Time Tagger. If she's still in my memory, she must play a vital role. Good! I wasn't planning on sitting on the bench this time. Incredible work, Party Crasher! Now all you need to do is send me the miraculous! Let's dance! Hey, wait a sec! King Monkey loves to party too! <laughs> Uproar! <laughs> Eat this! Seriously? What's going on? Sorry, I just love disrupting others' powers. <laughs> oh no! Shelter! Ha! Pegasus, teleport here and find something.
going to play this. <laughs> oh, pardon me, sir. I promise to return it after Paris is saved. <laughs> the only solution is to be so unpredictable that he can't read our dance steps. So, freak out! <laughs> What are you doing? It's nonsense! Puppeteer had a wand, remember? Then this puppeteer must have taken it. That's where the Akuma must be. Okay, who wants to play red light, green light? Nobody's up for hopscotch either. Enough jokes, Kitty. There's a little girl at stake. You know, lady. the worse the situation, the more I realize how amazing you are. How do you do that? Do what? I mean so much to you. How is it so easy for you to say these nice things to me, even in the worst situation? The really important things are the hardest to say, aren't they? It's precisely when something is important that it's important to say it, no matter what. <gasps> the workshop, she's got to be there. Ugh, got it. Ah, that's so gross. That should hold him for a bit. Wait up. We don't know what we're going to find behind the store. Let's stack the odds in our favor. Lucky charm! A cardboard tube? What am I going to do with this? I'll figure it out. Let's go! Nina, Nina, Nina! I've got tons of friends, but you? No one wants to play with you, Ladybug! You forget I always have my partner with me, Cat Noir! Really? Cat Noir, capture Ladybug! What's wrong with you? It's a statue! <laughs> You're not staying? Let's say I gotta stand ready to jump back into time and try something else, in case you fail. Little kitty on a roof. Cat Noir? Cat Noir. Oh. Lady? I thought I'd lost you. Oh, I was feline so sad that you uh, were gone. What's happened to you? No! Don't tell me. We're gonna fix everything. Of course we're gonna fix everything now that you're uh, back and now uh, that you're going to give me your miraculous. Uh, uh, <sighs> my miraculous? What's wrong with you, Cat Noir? Sorry, I didn't mean to be rude, milady. Could you please hand me your miraculous, please? Cat Blanc has gotten into some mischief. You've been akumatized, Cat Noir. You don't need my miraculous. You need me to de-evilize you. Let me help you. Save me. My poor kitty. Tell me, do you remember where the Akuma went? Oh. Oh. Here, but it's already broken. <laughs> now you're breaking more than my heart, Marinette! What? That video you sent to my friends. Unforgivable, Felix. Now that his father isn't here to stop him from getting into mischief... I don't deserve to be forgiven, Mom. I put my favorite cousin in danger. He's right. No apology can ever be enough. I just hope I can learn from this and come back to see you as a better person someday. I 
really am sorry. I'll do my best to make it up to you. And to you too, Uncle. Goodbye, Felix. Felix, wait! Adrian, stay here! If you're feeling upset or out of control, just call before you do anything you might regret. I'm really lucky to have you. Sorry, Plague. If Felix didn't destroy your cheese and steal my phone, none of this would have happened. Your cousin can come back whenever he wants! <laughs> um, did you know my friends recorded messages for me? What a nice thing to do. I've got an idea. <laughs> pew, 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 pew! <laughs> Hey guys, I never got your messages, but I'm really touched just knowing you were thinking of me today. You're the best friends anyone could ever dream of. I love you, all of you. I love you. I love you. I love you. Uh, I love you too, Adrian. I love you. Got a surprise for you, Mom. <gasps> but Gabriel refused to hand it over to me, and after everything that happened... My little magician, I can never understand how you always manage to get what you want. Keep it. It's yours now. But you wanted it so much. Only to give it to you. You've always been so fascinated by them. How many times have you asked me to tell you the story of the Gram de Vanilli twin rings, huh? Mm -hmm. I'm glad it's back in the family where it truly belongs. You're not Ladybug? No, she's not me. She's manipulating you. You know I'm already in love with someone else. Listen to your heart. Oh, listen to your brain. You're just an illusion. <laughs> See, I'm real enough. Impossible. There can't be two Ladybugs. She must be a fan of Ladybug who's been akumatized by a hot mob. Don't fall for her tricks. Milady, no! You've got a villain to fight. We'll take care of me later. That's the lady I know. Oh, I can't believe you fell for that! Okay, good job. You win. I am the fake ladybug. But there's no way I'm letting you cataclysm my earrings. What? Why does she... You want to bet? Oh, you cat noir. Cat no, not the earrings. Hello, Mayura. Huh? Mayura? But... She looks so real. Things aren't always what they seem to be at first sight. This ladybug isn't an illusion or an akumatized person. Uh-huh, she's a senti monster. But she's so much more elaborate than any of those we faced before. She's so perfect, there's nothing monstrous about her at all. Sorry, Katie, but you should have known. I'm nowhere near as perfect as her. I love you just the way you are, milady. Got a hint of where the amuck is. Look at what Mayura's holding. Whatever it takes, steal their miraculous from them and don't hold back. Senti charm! Whoa. I'll show you a real lucky charm! Okay, you're definitely the real one. <laughs> hey, help me! I'm stuck! Natalie? Nuru, why didn't you wake me up? I couldn't bring myself to, Master. You were sleeping so peacefully. My hero looks exhausted. That's her chance to bring her down and find out who's behind the mask. Cover your ears. I need oh. your help! This costume is very cute, miss, but is it really fitting in this place? Ah! Uh, 
forgot to transform back. Uh, never been followed, Master. I'm sure of it. Hmm. Ladybug, if you'd like to have a turn on the merry-go-round, please pick your favorite horse. Once the mission is over, you will retrieve the Miraculous and return it back to me. Bring me my Miraculous, Ladybug. I'm waiting for you. The dragon. Are you sure? Uh, yes, I'm certain. <laughs> my dear guardian, what a pleasure it is to finally meet you. <gasps> I'm honored that you've chosen me, Ladybug, but I thought you couldn't give me this miraculous again since Hawk Moth knows my identity. There's no time. I need your exceptional talent. Flag, close out! Don't look at me. I have to transform back. My Kwame needs to refuel. Spots off! I hope I didn't interrupt anything with... that boy. You did turn up a little... unexpectedly. I'm honored to see you again, Kagami-san. We are about to accomplish great things together. Honor is mine, Longsama. The boy's famous, isn't he? You're bound to break a lot of hearts. There's only one person I don't want to hurt. Marinette. She's the only other friend I have. But Adrian and I are made for each other. We're so alike. I can't give him up, even for the sake of friendship. Sometimes, choices can be so hard. We have a mission to do. Long, bring the storm! Tiki, spots on! You're powerless against me, old man. And Ladybug isn't here to protect you. Tell me the secret identities of Ladybug and Cat Noir. Never! Then help me get their miraculous, and I won't harm you. You're not getting anything from me. Wait! It's too dangerous, Master. You're too old for this. Shell on! Very impressive. Shelter! You're on borrowed time, you crazy old man. I'll just wait for you to transform back. My powers are no more time sensitive than yours. Obviously, you haven't learned anything about the miraculous Hawk Moth. I've learned enough to defeat you. The end of superheroes has come. You talk a lot, but you haven't achieved much so far. Your defeat will be my greatest achievement! <laughs> <laughs> nothing! There's nothing you can do! My plan was perfect! You can't beat me! <laughs> I can't figure it out! Focus! You can do it! <laughs> I'm sorry! I'm so useless! If I hadn't forgotten to detransform myself to go see Master Fu! Ladybug, no! Hawk Moth wouldn't have taken him hostage. He wouldn't have taken the Miracle Box. I'm the worst Ladybug that has ever existed. Ladybug, you are the best Miraculous Holder I've ever met. You made mistakes, but who hasn't? What matters is to fix them. You always, always miraculously knew how to fix everything, right? But what should I do, Master? You hold all the keys, Ladybug. You always have. And you will be the most magnificent of guardians. What? I, Wang Fu, hereby relinquish the Miracle Box and name Ladybug the new guardian. No! Master. No! It's my Miracle Box! Mine! I'm the guardian! I'm the queen! Ha ha! Tell him to give me my box back! How disappointing. I'll take care of them! You take care of the box! Sorry, but I think this belongs to me now. I don't need all those stupid miraculous anyway. I only need the queen bee. Besides, you're lame! And Paris is lame! I'm going to New York with Mommy, and I'll be the one and only Queen Bee there! And I'll save the world all by myself! Without you and your ridiculous, poorly chosen friends! Utterly poorly chosen! 
I'm sorry, Chloe, but I can't let you do that. Well, if that's the way it is, I'm no longer your fan, Ladybug. I don't love you anymore, and I'm still going to leave with Mommy anyway because you don't deserve to breathe the same air I do. 